Hi, this is Mark Mosier. Ableton has just released a new experimental feature in Live 12.1 that lets you export drift and drum racks if they're in the proper format to both Ableton Move and Ableton Note. So in this video, I'm going to demonstrate moving a preset. All the details on how to do this are at modulatethis.com slash move. For this experiment, I chose one of the presets I made while freelancing for the Ableton Berlin sound team. It's a drift preset called MPE Ghost Ship Pad, and it's in the Ableton Live Core, and it's in the Push 3 Core. So at this point, I've refactored the preset into the proper format and made the changes to options.txt so I can have the new option to export the preset from the rack template. When you export, you're presented with a dialog box on your laptop or your computer, so you can save this out with any name you like, and then you use the Move Manager through a browser to upload the preset to your Move. So now the preset's over on the Move. I created a new set. It randomized which base preset was in track two, and now I'm gonna replace it by pushing down on the encoder and pressing back until I get to user presets. And then I can now see the preset that I just uploaded. Since the push three has MPE and the move does not, I refactored the preset to use pressure to modulate pitch so I could do pitch dives with polyphonic pressure on the preset on the move. It's just so awesome to be able to bring drift presets you make or your favorite drift presets or drum racks down to the move and then have poly pressure and a battery powered portable unit. So if you want to learn all the details about how to do it, swing by modulatethis.com slash move. And I have a series of articles out there. I've already started on move and more coming along with all sorts of other blog posts. Oh, and while you're here, take a minute to subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's loaded with uh, years and years of performance videos and archives and some tip videos like this. So I hope you'll consider subscribing. Thanks for watching.